guys and welcome to another vlog I'm so excited for today because it's our fifth year anniversary with Ben Hi, happy anniversary to us <laughs> Yeah, and we want to take you with us to celebrate at Copa Club Tower Bridge which you might know because they're very famous for their igloos and we're actually kind of running late so I will see you there Here we are and guys, if you enjoy this type of content and you want to see more videos from London or travel related content, don't forget to subscribe. And for the ones of you that subscribed, here is a cute puppy as a reward. You excited? Very, very excited. It's the first time that we are out since ages. Actually, that's not true. Once we went to our uh, Thai restaurant that it's very close to us, but this was disappointing. So really fingers crossed that this one is better. What are you doing on our anniversary? Uh, I'm texting friends. Oh my gosh, you guys, it already feels so weird to be served, but I'm actually quite happy about that. And it's such a sunny and beautiful day. I'm loving it. And for some reason, I decided to show you the bathrooms as well. I guess I was just too excited. And this is how it looks on the inside in case you're curious or you're coming later in May or just in winter. This is the view that you can see from the outside. You can see Tower Bridge, the Shard, the river, and it's pretty great, but I have to say, depending on where your table is, you might not get the most perfect view, which was actually our case. Hello guys, just to update you, there is a slight pressure in here because we booked the table from 11 until 12.30 and you can't stay more if you're only two people so now we have like this rush, okay, let's order as soon as possible so the food arrives ASAP and we don't stay longer which is a bit of a pressure but it's such a beautiful day What do you think? Oh, it's really nice here, like the menu is really cool, I like it, I like it and I just want to eat so I went to the gym yesterday and we had the best my girlfriend is too funny. This is how we film the at the up. moment. This is for me. Yummy stuff, very yummy stuff. Mmm, very nice. Very good salmon. Hey, hey, whoa, whoa, come back, come back here. Voila, we saved it. Yeah, I got a sweet starter and after that I'm moving on to the savory. But let's see how it is. This is delicious. And it also feels quite healthy. Because you can really feel all the seeds that are inside. Cheers! Let's see. Oh, look at that! No, don't come. Hi everybody, I'm here. I'm gonna have my salmon. So we have the vegan burger, vegan mozzarella, vegan patty, yeah. and we have vegan patty, vegan patty, <laughs> vegan, vegan bread. Yes, and I also like the fact that they put so many seeds. Hear that? Is your your kid your kid consume the raw the bread? Uh, translation, please. Like basically little ears, you know, with like the tip of the broccoli, but doesn't look like it. Wait one second. This is peppers. But it's fine. Oh no, it's good. It's good. I just tried them and they're really, really good, really creamy, and you can really taste the Parmesan cheese. Mm. They're delicious. I think we'll just need some bread to make a scarpetta. Do you know that it has been one year that I'm making YouTube videos? How crazy is that? 
honestly it has been the best experience ever i have never literally felt so good in my life so i feel like i should also say thank you guys oh. it actually has a lot of salad which i kind of like and this is some kind of mustard it's our last 10 minutes here time literally flies but last piece of the burger i wanted to show you the mozzarella and i didn't even have time to eat the fries taste 10 out of 10 apart from the fries i think the fries bring it down a little bit but overall it's really good so decided that we can have some switch and look also how much sauce is guess how, guess how much it is that thing is only 10 pounds it's like free of course there's more, no mozzarella because my girlfriend ate all of it no no there is this is how the glues look from the outside but yeah. imagine living in here i'm quite curious how much are the apartments also a uh, money saving tip if you want to get the same view as the actual restaurant look at the benches here you can just take something to eat as those people were doing and you basically get the same view of tower bridge in total we paid 75 pounds which we i mean ben paid <laughs> it's fine <laughs> but I mean we got a lot of things so it was fine but I think what really put me off is the fact that they kept reminding us all the time how much time do we have left like a time bomb yeah exactly okay guys you okay. have cut the red cable cut the red cable guys you have 45 minutes guys you have half an hour 15 minutes I was like oh my god okay all this pressure you know so but I we left on time it was enough time to finish everything but like just having the constant person saying oh uh, you have to, like you know this amount of minutes left it, it just like puts you off apart from that i really enjoyed it and i think if you're oh and i didn't tell you we actually didn't go to the igloo itself because the minimum spent is 130 pounds yeah well, yeah what can you spend so, for like two people yeah for two people it's like, quite we, a lot A walk and of course I will take you guys with me and we can enjoy the sun because to be honest this April really doesn't feel like April it's more like December so and guys have you seen on TikTok all those videos about London secret beaches London's secret beach it's a, one of them it's actually here but I just want to show you the reality behind it yeah I mean you can go from the stairs down there but the thing is the water is actually quite dirty amazing London the best city in the world best beaches are just in London you know he's not really credible for the beaches look at the crystal clear water you know oh wow so two cool things in here what? number one first I of all I just want to say I don't see any of the cool things in here yeah, go ahead. <laughs> number, I don't know why we stopped. Number one, yeah. in London there are so many cool benches. Like go this ahead. one. Let me show you, let me show you. Okay, Ben is gonna show you how to sit in case in case you don't know how. Okay, <laughs> very sophisticated. And also the stairs over there, aren't they so cool? Such a nice design. Another cool thing you can do in London is you can rent one of those boats. By the time I show you, they will be all gone. If you enjoyed this video and you want to see more videos like that, don't forget to subscribe because I see that still 80% of you watching are not subscribed. And then we went for some coffee because, you know, coffee is my life. Welcome to the Colombian Coffee Company. Here we've got some really beautiful single origins showcasing Colombia's finest flavors, really. Oh, so wow. for instance, we've got the Bourbon here. It's got some lovely rich cacao notes and a delicate apple acidity. Highly recommend that in something like a Tinto, which is a paper filter process. Here we use a Chemex. We also have the Yellow Couture. It's got some, mm, it's 
it's really about this like grapefruital acidity to it and it's got some lovely cacao notes it lands on. Our Tipica here for me has these like bold honey tones as well as these sort of cinnamon and caramel notes with it. And the Katora here has got these gorgeous sort of uh, raspberry and milk chocolatey tones to it. And our decaf has, is a Castigia, which has got these very classical nutty and chocolatey tones in it. And you measure it. Yeah, so we measure it out. So for How many grams am I getting? So for an espresso, I'll, I'll weigh 21 grams. Grinding fresh is key. With our espresso base drinks, I'll weigh oh, okay. 20.5. Hi you, what are you doing? Hi. What are you, up, what are you up to? I'm just enjoying the sun mm -hmm. because it feels too good after too good all to go. the winter. Yes, mm. it just feels too good after all the winter. And I would really appreciate it if you like and subscribe and I will see you in this next video. Love you all. Bye.